Hello everyone, I'm the Ninja Turkey, and welcome back to Let's Play Mario Kart 8. Uh, so last time I believe we did the Flower and Star Cup, and now we're gonna go ahead and move on to probably uh, the Special Cup. We might do two. Um, if we do two, I just want to uh, I just want to uh, basically tell you guys what I'm gonna be doing uh, after I beat the Special Cup, j just in case we end up doing two cups instead of just one. Um, basically, I wanted to get all four of these main ones done, and then move on to these bottom ones, which have, uh, like, basically re-releases of old tracks. And then once we've done these eight, we're gonna move on to these four cups, which are all DLC. So, um, yeah, that's the plan, but before we move on to that, we have to get the special cup done, so we are going to head, go, we are going to go ahead and do that. It's been a little while since I've recorded this game. Um, I don't know, probably like a week or more. <laughs> I've uh, not only have I been busy with you know getting back into school because I'm back in Grand Junction for school now, and that kind of made it you know more difficult to record. Um, I'm also I I've also started. Um, two Let's Plays since I, um, since I, uh, start originally started this Let's Play. Like, I, I started this Let's Play originally kind of as something quick to do, um, to test out my HDMI capture card. Um, but then, uh, like, I, I started it when I was in Wisconsin visiting family, because I have a bunch of family there. Um, figuring, like, okay, well, I'm here visiting family, I'm not gonna have a whole bunch of time to record anything major, like, you know, the games I'm recording now, um, so I started this one up, <clears throat> but I didn't do as much of this one as I thought when I was in Wisconsin, you know, at, as I thought I would do, um, because, you know, I was busy with family, I wasn't going to be recording all the time, I was basically just recording when the family I was visiting was at work, uh, so, like... You know, I didn't get a lot of this done, and so this is still going on. But in the meantime, I have also uh, started both Pokemon Emerald and The Legend of Zelda Spirit Tracks, which are both pretty long games in general. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I, um, I don't know, I've, I've got a lot of work to do. I, I set off to record um, today, and I... Like, I, I remember thinking, like, oh, I have three games to choose from, what should I- Jeez, I'm getting hit left and right here. I was like, oh, I have, you know, three different games to choose from. No. Well, actually, four different games, because I'm also doing, um... I'm gonna get rid of this banana. I'm also doing, uh, Persona 3, which I've kind of let slide for a while. <laughs> So yeah, I was like, I feel like recording. What should I play? I have four games to play, and I was like, you know, I should probably get this one out of the way since it's a relatively short game. So yeah, here we are. Um, still have a ways to go before we finish it, and I'll probably still be doing this Let's Play even as I'm still recording Pokemon Emerald Spirit Tracks and Persona 3, but you know. I just, the fact that I just got an HDMI capture card just makes me really excited to record again. Um, not that I wasn't super excited about recording before, because, you know, I, I recently finished Paper Mario, which I did with my regular SD capture card, <coughs> and, you know, that, that was fine. It's not like I have any issues recording that, but just getting an HDMI capture card opened up so many possibilities, you know, like all these games that I've considered playing before but never really could, because I didn't have H an HDMI capture card. Just really... Oh, wow. Second. We're gonna have to do better next time. Um, just, you know, ma made me start up a whole bunch of games. And you know what's ironic about, about all this, now that I'm thinking about it, is that technically all the games that I'm Let's Playing right now, I don't really need an HDMI capture card for. <laughs> like... I mean, this this game is on the Wii U, which does have a, um, which does have component out, or like SD out, but I mean, I don't want to record a Wii U game from, you know, an SD resolution when, like, 
I, it has a perfectly good HDMI port that would make the quality of the video so much better, so... That's why I haven't really recorded any Wii U games from... Oh, Jesus Christ, guys. I'm not doing so well this, uh, this time. No, not sure why, but hopefully we'll catch up here. Um, but yeah, I was like, I thought, you know, I could record from the Wii U if I really wanted to, but... I'm just gonna wait until I have an HDMI capture card, because it looks so much better that way. And I can't hit anybody with these. Darn. Um, so yeah, um, and then also, on the same subject, uh, Spirit Tracks I'm recording via, um, via the Wii U through Virtual Console, and so same deal there, which that probably doesn't matter as much considering, you know, um, considering, uh, where am I going with this? Considering that the DS doesn't have great graphics anyway, but I figure that I figure that, you know, might as well get it as good as we possibly can. And then with Persona 3, obviously, that's SD. That's on the PS2, so that that's beside the point. Um, but, um, yeah, and then Pokemon Emerald, I'm recording off my Retron 5, which only has HDMI out, so I guess you could put... You could say that that one requires HDMI, but I could also be playing that game on a ROM or something, so... There are ways to record all the games I'm playing without HDMI, but... The point is, now that I have an HDMI capture card, I want to record all these videos in the best quality possible. Um... And then also, once all four of these Let's Plays are done... Eventually, <laughs> it might be a while, considering... I mean, this, this game that we're playing now will be over pretty quickly, but... Considering that Spirit Tracks, Pokemon Emerald, and Persona 3 are all pretty long games, it's gonna be a while before I start up anything else, unless it's like a relatively short series like this. Um, but when, you know, once once those are done, there are just a ton of HDMI games I want to play. And, oh shit. And I don't really know what those are gonna be, like what the next ones will be, but point is, I'm excited. There's there's a lot of Let's Playing to be done in the future. Um, and you know, also, now that I'm on that subject of, like, future projects to do, um, I don't know if or when I'll actually do this, but, um, uh, I've been thinking about doing, like, some shorter projects. Like, not necessarily shorter games, but, like, <clears throat> basically doing a game it doesn't the length doesn't really matter and not finishing it like a lot of let's players do that these days they'll like do like a one or two maybe three or four part series on something and then just stop for whatever reason just because they don't want to do the whole thing they just want to show off a little bit of it i think doing something like that might be kind of cool but you know as a as a let's player like I, I kind of want to f do games all the way through, which is rich coming from me, because I've actually, um... There's actually plenty of games that I've started and never finished, but... I, you know, I hope to get back to a lot of those, at some point, at least. Um, but yeah, I don't know, I kind of like the idea of doing short series like that, just like, oh, here's a cool game, let's do, let's do two episodes of it, but... I don't know if I'll do that, and if I do do that, I don't know when it'll be... And I don't know, like, what game either. Um, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll see. It's just something that I've considered doing that may or may not happen in the future. Um, I had something else I wanted to say kind of on that same subject, but I can't quite remember what it was. Uh, let's see, what was I talking about? I feel like it was important, <laughs> but of course now I don't remember. I think it had something to do with... Well, it was about recording... Oh, no, 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 now I remember. It didn't really have anything to do, actually, with um, with what games I'm going to be recording, but in a video uh, in a video I did of New Super Mario Bros. Uh, for the Wii, that when I actually... I actually did try to do a full Let's Play of that, which someday I do hope to actually accomplish that, but that particular Let's Play, I never finished. It's only, like, two episodes long. Um, but the point is, I remember... I remember talking 
Or, oh crap, is he gonna hit me? Don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. I think we're gonna make it. Okay. Okay, we're good. Um, I remember in that Let's Play I was talking about a new and old, like, style Let's Players, and if you've seen that video, maybe you remember. Um, but basically what that video was about, or like what, it, what the commentary was about was, and I'll, I'll talk about it again now, because I guess that series is dead anyway, so might as well rehash it. Um, basically, I, um, I came up with the idea, and I, th I think I came up with this idea with my friend. We, we were talking about it one day, and I uh, just kind of regurgitated what we what we talked about on the episode. Um, basically, we thought that there are two different types of Let's Players. So there's the older style and the newer style. And the older style is like, you know... You know, let, Let's Plays since the beginning is how I, I guess I would put it. Like, so like I don't know, I don't know if you guys have seen these Let's Players, but some examples would be, uh, like some of my favorites would be Big Dip on a Bus, Dark Minded Sith, Griffin Lobster, people like that. People and and they kind of have a casual, non-professional, more like dude in his basement playing video games type feel, you know. Like, it, it's just a dude hanging out, playing games, nothing nothing too serious. Kind of like what I'm doing now. I consider myself more of an older style. Um, whereas the newer styles um, are more professional, for, for better or worse. Like, and examples of those would be, like, your Markiplier's, your Game Grump... Well, Game Grumps, I don't know. They're kind of in between, but I'd say they're more new style than they are old, old style. Uh, but yeah, like Markiplier, Jacksepticeye, PewDiePie, all the all the YouTubers, all the gaming YouTubers who are really popular today, and like the big differences between those um, different styles, like I don't know, let me think. So I've already said that the old styles are more casual, less professional, and the new styles are more professional. Um, but what else? Um, there, there's lots of differences. Um, I guess. Oh, here, here's one. This is why I brought up this topic at all in the first place, is, um... Oh, and hey, we're on Rainbow Road. I didn't even realize until now. Um, this is why I brought this topic up in the first place, because I was talking about doing, like, shorter series, where it's like I play two or three episodes of a game and then stop. Like, not in every case, obviously. Like, New Style Let's Players do finish games, but I feel like in most cases, New Style Let's Players, um... They either play shorter games that take, like, only a few episodes to complete, or they will start a game but not finish it, if that makes sense. So, well, I guess how couldn't that make sense? But, like, and I don't know if that's, like, to appeal to people so that, so, you know, their content is more bite-sized and people don't have to stick around as long, but, I mean, it just seems like newer, newer Let's Players will either, as I said, will either play shorter games or will quit playing a game after a few episodes. And that's obviously not always the case, but that tends to be what they do. Whereas old style Let's Players tend to finish games, like they're, they're, they're usually in it for the long haul. Um, you know, they, they, they generally start a game with the intention of finishing it, and usually they play longer games as opposed to shorter games. It's just an observation I've had. And also, while we're on the subject, um, kind of kind of a weird difference, I guess, and I guess it depends on the, the, the Let's Player, but new style Let's Players often have webcams, whereas old style ones don't. Um, I don't know, just, just something I've noticed, like all your Markipliers and PewDiePies and all them, they have, um, webcams, but like Big Dip on a Bus, Dark Minded Sith, they hardly ever show their face. In fact, I think Big Dip on a Bus, I saw a video of his, like, a few months ago, where he showed his face, and like, he's been on YouTube for like, I don't know, 10 years or something, and that was like the first time that I know of that he showed his face, and it's like, kind of surprising. It was kind of weird to see his face, like, man, this guy I've been watching for all these years, had no idea what he looks like, but now we know. 
Whereas with Markiplier, you know, you 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 know where, who he is from the first video, you know, or, or maybe not the very first, but practically. So, I don't know. Just an interesting topic, something I, I like to muse on as a Let's Player myself. Um, not that either is necessarily better than the other. I mean, you could argue one way or the other, but I like both. I watch both. I watch a lot of Markiplier. I watch Big Dip on a Bus. I like both styles. They're just... They're both Let's Players, but they're both different, you know? And I, I explained a lot of the differences, but some of the differences are kind of hard to pin down. Another big difference, though, that I just thought of is new style Let's Players don't tend to call their videos Let's Play. Like, they don't say Let's Play whatever, it's usually just like whatever episode blank. Whereas Let's Player, older Let's Players, whereas not always, tend to put the, you know, Let's Play name on their video. So, and of course, there are, there are, uh, variations to this, but just what I've noticed, kind of a fun topic, I think, to go over Mario Kart 8. <laughs> yeah, and how did I get into that again? I guess it was, yeah, recordings I might do in the future and doing shorter recordings, and I don't know if that'll happen or not, but we'll see. I'll always be an old style let's player. I'm not going to go to the level to the level of professionalism that freaking uh, new style let's players have. They're like in it. They're like way in it. And plus, they make the big bucks too more than the old style let's players. Oh, and I guess here's the credits. So maybe I should shut up. But I'm not quite done talking. <laughs> um. Yeah, I don't know. That is another big difference. Is new style let's players are way more popular and tend to make way more money. But, I don't know. I guess that's all I have to say. I should probably be quiet because of the credits. I usually like to be quiet during the credits. So, yeah, I'm going to do that. Um, even though we haven't finished the game yet. I don't know if this is the only time we'll see the credits. So, I'm going to shut up. And, uh, guess I'll end the episode here. The episode will end when the credits are done. So, yeah, next time I guess we'll start on the... Uh, bottom four tracks. We'll do the uh, remake tracks or whatever you want to call them. Uh, so yeah, cool. Um, guess I'll see you guys next episode. Thank you guys for watching.